It is a women's bantamweight matchup between Ronda Rousey and Raquel Pennington. All right, without further delay, let's get you tonight's tale of the tape. Even matchup here on paper, a lot of similarities across the board, evenly matched when it comes to the numbers. Here. Ready to fight. Ready. Here we go. You know, Joe, not a lot of people envision Raquel Pennington as a future Bantamweight contender when she came off of the Ultimate Fighter, but through hard work, dedication, and a constant focus on improvement, that is exactly what Raquel Pennington is here as she approaches the prime of her career. Pennington trying to make it six straight wins as she takes to the octagon tonight. Oh, good defense here to stay upright after that single leg takedown offering. All right, first round is underway, and you better watch out for the overhand punches when you're fighting an opponent of this caliber. It really has become a patented punch of hers, and something that a lot of opponents know is coming, but still can't account for. Oh, huge hand, hand! This could be it right here. Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? Powerful right hand. How about that chin? Well, Joe, I know she's got a lot of faith in her chin, but that is not a good look. Oh! This could be it. Nasty combinations here. She tagged her. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. Trying to spin to the back. Both hooks in. She's in half guard now. Nice hammer fist. She establishes full mount. Nice shot to the head. Oh, and now an elbow up top by Rouse. One of the best arm bars in the business, going for it now. This arm bar is getting deeper and That's there it is. Close. A beautiful job in setting up this arm bar. Excellent technique. Yeah, she could have drawn it up much better, Joe. And just the way she transitioned in her grappling to first secure the arm and then torque it to get the submission finish, that is a big, big result here tonight. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. So there she is, your winner by way of submission. A huge result for her here tonight. And you gotta think that'll mute some of the naysayers she had coming in. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 41 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by submission, we do an arm bar, Ronnie Ronda Rousey!
It is a women's bantamweight matchup between Ronda Rousey and Maureen Renault. All right, without further delay, let's get you tonight's tale of the tape. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and the same reach. You ready? You ready? Let's go well, it's always great to be back in this MMA hotbed as we get underway here at the Jeunesse Arena in Rio de Janeiro. And she's down! Oh, clipped her with the jab. That one hurt. She missed with that jab. Good job of timing strikes here. Oh, big shot. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Start to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Oh, she landed the one-two there. Well, she continues to do a great job with the leg kicks in this round. She told us coming in, she had to slow her opponent down, mess with her feet a little bit, and that is exactly what she has accomplished here in this round. Oh, nice. Renault gets caught by the inside leg kick. Oh, she... Oh! oh this could be it! Back up! Hard hook! Wow! Back up! This could be it right here. Two minutes have expired off the round one clock here. That's a really strong leg kick there by Rousey. Visibly limping here. Well, Rousey's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Well, she ain't that hook shot like a champion, Joe, but she's got it. Oh, vicious! Oh. She got cracked in the head. She's stunned. This could be it. Oh, oh, nice! Oh, that was a powerful kick to the body. Just over two minutes to go in what has been... Oh. 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 Tremendous hook on the button for the win. Yeah, Joe, that'll get the crowd on its feet. A near-perfect land to end the fight for her here tonight. Just the way she drew it up, she had her focus on the knockout, and that's exactly the way this fight ends. I'm not even sure the opponent saw the shot coming. They oftentimes say it's the shot you don't see coming that spells your fate, and that certainly spelled her fate here tonight. Let's see that again from another angle. Take a look at this from a different angle. Boom! Right on the money. Well, there she is. Man, did she have it going here tonight as she gets the huge win by knockout. Near perfect execution. And that could be one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliana calls a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 56 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Fighters fight for many different reasons. Some do it for the fame, others do it for the money. Eventually, all of that fades away. Yet going down in the history books as a UFC champion is something no one can ever take. It's proof that for a moment in time, out of all the fighters in your weight class, you were the best in the world. It's the culmination of all your hard work, the fulfillment of a dream. Tonight is your chance to take that gold belt and hear Bruce Buffer say, and new. That kind of glory lasts forever. It's a women's Bantamweight title fight between Amanda Nunes and Ronda Rousey. 
our tale of the tape for this women's Bantamweight Championship fight. Well, at least on paper, what an even matchup here. Everything between these two fighters is nearly identical coming in here tonight. Oh. You ready? You ready? Let's go All right, here we go. UFC Women's Bantamweight title is on the line. Well, you can feel the tension in the building. Here we go, early round one of this UFC Women's Bantamweight Championship fight. For the champion, the focus keeping the belt. For the number one contender, not letting this opportunity slip through the cracks. This is her first title fight. She has bided her time, waited a long time. Wow! This could be it. Vicious combinations. And she caught the kick. Just missed with a huge kick. Well, she continues to leave that head open, and she paid for it there. She's almost moving into the strike. She hasn't changed up her tempo, and she continues to keep her head on that center line. We'll see if she can make the proper adjustments here. She's doing a real nice job timing these shots, staying busy. Very good look for the judges here. Going for the takedown here. Under three minutes now to go in round one. Holding that front headlock position. She's got this submission locked. Tremendous pressure on the neck. That's and a there it is. Set up the choke, completed the job, and got the victory. Well, they get the desired result here tonight, Joe. You know she's been working hard on her submissions, and clearly it played out that way here tonight. A near-perfect setup on the choke. She clearly got it sunk in deep and ultimately forces her high-level opponent to tap out. Crazy turn of events here tonight. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So there she is celebrating with her corner, the queen of the 135ers, the UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion. And how about the method of victory tonight as she gets it done by submission? Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 36 seconds in the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out and new undisputed UFC bantamweight champion.